In this video we're going to show you how to calibrate a Tanita 1479V. Um, this particular scale we have is, we find is way off. We're going to turn the scale on. You'll see the scale powers up. And if I throw on a 100 gram certified weight, it's reading 100, I'm sorry, it's reading 98.1. So it's off by almost 2 grams. And if I use a 50 gram weight, the scale reads 50.7, so it's off by 0.7 grams. And if I put on a 20 gram weight, it reads 20.8. If I put on another 20 grams, it reads 40.8. So the scale is just way, way off. Now a lot of people don't know, but you can calibrate a Tanita 1479. And the reason why we're seeing these errors or inconsistency for the weigh-in results is the Tanita works off of a capacitance load cell, which is basically the voltage between two plates. So as you apply a force to the platform, put 50 grams, those plates squeeze together. And you put on another 50 grams or 100 grams, they're even closer. And so what the uh, electronics are doing is it's reading the voltage between those two plates. So to calibrate the scale, it's not in the manual, but we'll show you how to do it. The first thing you want to do is shut off your scale. And what you want to do is you want to press and hold the off button down, and we're going to press the on tear button. It's actually four times. So one, two, three, four. And the scale should go off. But let me take off my gloves. So I hold the off button and I go one, two, three, four. And still can't do it. Let's turn it on one minute. Let's turn it off. One, two, three, four. And there it is. So you have to go fast, I guess. Four fast buttons. So you'll see the scale reads 100, and then it reads 100.1. So when it says 0.1, you need to put on half the load, 50 grams. And then it's going to go 100.2, and you have to put on your other 50 grams. And then the display is going to reset and show end. And so you know the calibration has now been completed. So if I turn on the scale, the scale does the power up, and now it's back to 0.0. .0. And if I throw on my 50 grams, now it reads 49.9, which is a lot better than before. Another 50 grams reads 99.99, which the scale reads plus or minus, oh, there it is, 100 grams. It reads plus or minus a tenth of a gram. Tear the scale out. I'm going to put on my certified weight, and 100 grams reads 99.9. So again, the way you want to calibrate the scale, you need to have the two 50 gram calibration weights. You simply hold down the off button and press the on tear button four times. The scale will show 100, then it will go 100.1, you put on 50 grams. The display will then show 100.2. You put on the additional 50 grams. And then the scale will reset and show end. And the scale has now been calibrated. A few other features about the 1479. It's a very basic scale. It only weighs in grams only. On the rear of the scale, you'll notice Tanita put a hologram on it. I guess there's a lot of fake 1479s on the market, so you need to be careful. The scale also operates off of... Uh, three button batteries. So the three button batteries are in this compartment. You need to be careful when opening the scale. A lot of times people will call these tabs break off because they push too hard. There are three button batteries in here and Tanita really should put a foil on here so that the batteries aren't being used. But there's no foil so sometimes people will call and say gee the batteries they're dead. Well you know, we're just taking these out of the MasterCard. We're, we're not responsible for the batteries. I mean, they're just brand new units. Um, you can buy these button batteries at uh, Walmart, any watch battery store, etc. These are just button batteries. Uh, again, the Tanita really should have a foil on the back of the batteries so that the batteries aren't in use, but Tanita decided not to do that when they manufactured the product. So this is the Tanita 1479V. Uh, we do have these in stock if you go to balances.com or visit our new website, scaleman.com. 
We hope this video was informative, showing you how to calibrate a Tanita 1479V.